Hi guys and welcome to another pregnancy update. I am 23 weeks and 4 days today. I'm sorry, I kind of feel like the camera is a little crooked. So I'm sorry about that if it kind of feels like it's tilted a little. So sorry about that. Also, I apologize that I missed last week's update. It was my kids' spring break and we were just really busy and had a lot going on. So I never got around to doing my 22 week update. So I'm sorry. And not only that, but this one's really late. So I'm going to be 24 weeks in just a few days. So this week at almost 24 weeks pregnant, the baby is a little over a foot long. So that's like the size of a ruler. That's pretty crazy. And um, he weighs about one and one fourth pounds so that's awesome to think that he's passed the pound mark now and that he's just starting to get so much bigger and speaking of him getting bigger that means his movements have been getting super crazy the other day i actually felt like a little body part like it was really little and i could like kind of grab it and kind of like wiggle it back and forth so that was really cool to like feel like an actual body part and not just trying to guess what it is but it felt like a little knee or something because it was round um, so that was really fun and also with movements my husband got to feel him move for the first time so that was really exciting we've been trying to catch him forever and every time I would tell him to come and hurry fill and move and then it's like the second he put his hand there then he would stop so but this time um, he was able to catch him and he gave him a pretty good little kick and he's felt him a couple times since then so it's fun that he's able to feel him now and I just I like that part where they can you know your husbands or whoever can actually feel them too and not just you some symptoms that I've been having this week is well this one isn't every day but one day I had the most insane heartburn it was Oh my gosh, it was terrible. I ended up taking um, like four Tums and that's the only way that I could get it to subside enough to where I could go to bed. And it was just out of control. So I'm trying to like not eat after a certain time at night because I find that if I do, then that kind of stirs the heartburn up. I don't really have it during the day, but I, just, I find it more at night when I lay down. So I just try to be careful with what I eat before bed and try not to eat you know for a couple hours before bedtime which can be kind of hard sometimes when you're pregnant because you get hungry so <sighs> and going along with that another symptom that I've been having which is kind of gross is burping I have been burping so much and I usually <laughs> am not a big burper like I don't do a whole lot of that but it just seems like this pregnancy has made me extremely burpy so but I guess it's, I'm just glad it's coming out that end and not the other <laughs> And another embarrassing thing that's been happening, so I'm sorry, but you know what? I'm pregnant. So is I, um, if I laugh too hard or if I cough really hard or something, or sometimes even if I sneeze, like I'll pee just like a little tiny bit. Oh my gosh, I know. I'm sorry. It's so embarrassing. But it's only happened a couple times and I... <laughs> I try to just make sure that my bladder is always empty so that doesn't happen, but it's happened a couple times and that's it's really embarrassing, but what can I do? So that's really all that's been happening as far as symptoms, but this week I feel like he is, either I have or he has had a huge growth spurt. I just feel huge. I feel enormous. Like I feel like I look like I am nine months already when I'm almost only six so I don't know if it's just me but I just feel really big and along with that it just I feel like he's moving up really high I don't I must just be carrying him really high because I can feel him way above my belly button like when he kicks and stuff and so I just feel like it's putting more pressure on my lungs so I just feel like sometimes I'm out of breath like you know after going up the stairs or I just feel like I I'm out of breath easier or like after I eat something and that's not a very pleasant feeling but at least it's a good sign that he's growing and getting bigger. One thing that I've started doing that's been kind of helping that is I started doing just some light pregnancy aerobics just really moderate 
um, exercises and that has helped me feel so much better because if you've like followed me for a while you know that I am an avid exerciser I um, I like to go running but um, and when I was sick in the first few months I didn't do any kind of exercising so I started feeling kind of crappy because of it and so this last week I just decided I'm like okay I just need to start doing some kind of exercising so I found um, a few maternity aerobic exercise videos so I've been doing those and then plus I'm um, on the days I don't do that I try to go on a walk because it's been really nice outside and so I'm just trying to do some kind of exercise and that has been helping me feel a lot better one other thing I forgot to mention is I I have had a couple varicose veins pop up in the back of my legs and so that's been giving me kind of a little bit of leg aches but again the exercising has been helping with that as well and so um, they're not pleasant or fun and they're not cute but a lot of women get them when they're pregnant and my mom got them when she was pregnant and it's just something that I unfortunately have so those haven't been very fun but like I said the exercise has been helping um, with the pain that they've been causing so that really does it for symptoms and things that have been going on over the last like week or two weeks since I updated last I have um, a prenatal appointment with my midwife next Tuesday so in about five days and we get to have another ultrasound again so yay for that so exciting to be able to see him on ultrasound so um, we will be able to get to see him again and I will share with you guys in my next week's update how that went and everything and yeah weight gain I you know I haven't weighed myself in a few days but the last time I weighed myself I hadn't gained anything since um, my last update at 21 weeks so but I don't know I haven't weighed myself in the last few days so that could have changed but as far as I know I haven't gained anything since a couple weeks ago but I will update that next week as well after I've been to the doctor and stuff and they weigh me and all that so that does it for this update and I guess I will go ahead and show you guys my 23 week and four day belly and then I will be on my way so thanks for watching and please if you have any questions just leave them in the comments Please subscribe and thanks for all your guys' support. You guys are all so amazing and I guess I will talk to you next week for week 24. Bye! So here it is from the front. I came in my daughter's room because I had better light. And here it is from the side. From the other side. Like I said, I really blossomed out, I think. And then... And there it is from the front. And from the side. And then from this side. Again. So there he is.